Hello friends, hi guys, I am Mohammed Javed Kulji, the author of Non-Reciprocal Dynamics of Moving Bodies. It is a depiction of the real theory of relativity. In fact it is the next generation physics. This book is available on Amazon. Let me walk through how the established concept of relative motion, forming the core base of special relativity theory finds its genesis in a glaring illusion. This concept seems to have been inspired from momentary phenomena for example your moving train passes close to stationary train, the stationary train looks moving and moving one stationary. And as soon as the surroundings are visible, this phenomenon disappears exactly as the dreams disappear when you wake up. Though both the phenomena and dreams are momentary and their occurrence is real yet they are not real themselves. Can the dreams be the base of your life? No way. So how can the momentary illusion, be the base of your physical laws? No way. So we have redefined relative motion in the light of real time analysis of the universe. And the whole relativity is redone including the transformation laws. We have found that vectors and vector borne scalars are reciprocal but pure scalars show inverse variation. Flexible acceleration at sea is a new concept. The light exists in the waveform only because of this acceleration. Since 2004 many of my research papers in different international journals attracted readership through the journal sites as well as through EBSCO, High Beam Research, ADS NASA, ResearchGate, Academia.edu, Google Scholar, etc. Let us begin the subject with a very interesting story of Newton and Einstein. See the full video with animation ahead. I did have a dream, where, Sir Isaac Newton of 17th century and Sir Albert Einstein, of 20th century, each in his car, are in an open field where miles together, they find no surroundings. Einstein is to reach, his office, in North while, Newton, in South, suddenly, Newton, finds his car ain't working. He requests Einstein to send, Einstein's car after reaching his office. Einstein promises as his driver is driving while he is on the back seat, from where he can see far off things nicely, but not the ground or road so well. While moving he looks back, and finds Newton's car heading southwards. So, Einstein doesn't send his, car for Newton. Next day Newton complains he couldn't reach office. Please watch, the interesting conversation ahead between them. Hello Einstein, are you okay? You had kept me waiting whole day yesterday and you didn't turn up. Whenever I looked back while I was in motion I found your car heading southward. And this I did a number of times and every time it appeared as if my car is motionless. But it didn't bother me rather I was happy as you were heading your way. Got it. Some two centuries after my leaving this world, you brought about great revolution in physics but with a disregard to classical concept of physics where rest and motion were separate identities. As per your theory they are no longer separate now but are relative terms. Could you please elaborate on it? Alright, they are relative terms. If you assume being at rest you will observe my car moving. Likewise when I assume myself motionless while moving, to me your car appears moving with the same magnitude in opposite direction. So I am in motion relative to you and vice versa. Therefore, if I move relative to you with plus B, you will be moving relative to me with than the same event at the same point of time. Let us see animation, sir. There is no absolute rest or absolute motion. Relative to you I am in motion what you observe and relative me you are in motion what I observe in the same event. Magnitude is common between us. How, well, you mean to say both claim that they are at rest, even the one who is in motion. So each finds the other in motion vis a vis his position of rest. Right sir. I draw an analogy of young couple where the husband tells his wife, I am your wife. The wife too repeats the same, I am your wife, both claim the womanhood and the status of wife. Sir, the result will be same. They will produce child. The wife and the husband both claim that they are carrying baby.
who the doctor should examine. Sir Einstein, this book, Non-Reciprocal Dynamics of Moving Bodies, is very intriguing. The author Mr. Kilji seems to have fallen, your line. Yet, he, secures, the separate identities, of rest and motion, the established concept of classical physics, in his redefined relative motion. Only the inverse law is different from Lorentz 1. Under these laws Maxwell equations are invariant. Here, also mass increases but at sea matter, transforms it into photons. Time flies with velocity but dilates at rest, good example, of the lightning flash, and thundering sound. Moving length, lengthens, but contracts, at rest. A stream, of photons, appear. In the form of ray, only. Because of lengthening, with contraction. It appears, in dashes or dots. Above all, his concept of flexible. Acceleration. Keeps the light, into, waveform. Otherwise it was a rigid rod. With zero, acceleration at sea. The non-reciprocity indicates that rest and motion are separate identities. Unlike special relativity it is not a vector-dominated theory. It is an ongoing process which can't stop on you or me. This pursuit of betterment makes science different from religion, which is unquestionable. Any question for the betterment in religion means atheist or infidel or a new religion. But any change for the betterment is welcomed in science, provided the logic doesn't violate fundamental laws and is well translated into mathematics that supports experimental results. What a wonderful dream it was. I received blessings, of Sir Isaac Newton and Sir Albert Einstein, on my work as if, they were asking me to go ahead. And make my work public. Please like the first part, subscribe it and share it and continue with the second part. The second part is about non-reciprocal dynamics of moving bodies, the real theory of relativity, redefined relative motion consequently new transformation laws, only inverse law, is different from the Lorentz one. Accordingly, the relativistic relations, mass velocity, time variance, length variation etc. flexible acceleration, a new concept which provides waveform to stream of photon. With zero acceleration at sea, the ray would be a rigid rod.